Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on how to do a RAM preview in Vegas Pro 15. So make sure you leave a like and subscribe and let's get right into this video. So the first thing you want to want to do is go up to options and then down to preferences. And then you want to go over here to video. And then up here you'll see the dynamic range preview maximum. Um, my Mac, I only have 8 gigs in this system so I can only go up to 7 gigs um, with Vegas. But So I went up to 6 uh, six gigs right here you want to go up to as much as you can without like crashing your computer because this will make it so you can do as long as RAM as long as the RAM preview as you want so what you have to do is you gotta get this little uh, scrubber uh, like scrubber bar up here with these yellow triangles this is the spot that you're gonna be doing the preview so I usually do this um, to just where I want to view where it might be like glitching and then you want to go push shift and B it'll go slowly um, it's not playing it back. It's just doing the RAM preview. It's just putting in the RAM. So sometimes this could take a little while depending upon how good your RAM is. But this one's going pretty quick. And you can see the frames up here. It's going frame by frame. Uh, putting them in the RAM. So if I go to task manager, I, I'd probably see quite a bit of RAM being used. Okay, so I think, that, I think that's all we need for this video. So... So you can see a lot of memories being used right now by Vegas Pro. So yeah, it's finished now. So if you preview this back, it looks really nice and it's constantly at 30 frames per second. And it's at best full, which is like really hard for my system to do because I don't have a very good computer right now. So yeah, it just makes it look nice. Um, I'll do the like right here where I'm doing the biking trick uh, for Shift B. And then it kind of goes in slow motion. Then if you want to end it any time, just push the space bar. See, yeah, it looks really nice now. So make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe and leave a comment what you want to see next. So yeah, thanks for watching.